Well, I'm headed back to Whole Foods. It's uh, Monday, raining, sprinkly, 39 degrees. <clears throat> I guess it's 40. No, my little uh, doodad thing right here says 36 degrees. Ooh, I don't like 36. <clears throat> I never even unloaded my truck last night. I just locked her up in the driveway. We'll see how it goes today. Now, on a side note, yesterday's video I posted on my gravedigger site, and a lot of y'all said, Oh, I was wondering where y'all were, where you've been doing, and all this and all that. Well, you know, I've been de sharpening it, I ain't been hunting much, so. I've been doing a lot of videos, but I'm putting them on my uh, knife site, Max the Knife Sharpening. So if you're interested in more knives, you can go over there. I don't do one every day, but almost every day. Max the Knife Sharpening, YouTube. Thumbs up, I like it, or subscribe, or whatever it is you're supposed to do. Okay, let's see how it goes. Well, I'm set up. It's about 10 minutes to 12. Scaled back today. I just brought, I mean, I got all the sharpeners in the truck, but I don't anticipate doing any any knives. And if I do, I'll have to just walk over there and get the other couple and bring them over here. But I'm just going to set up for one right now. Okay, my phone's ringing. Stand by. Look at that, look at that. I got three already. Holy Toledo! A lady bring me some more knives right now. <laughs> Here we go, customer number two. Chicago cutleries, and I don't know what this chicken is here. I may have to go get more of the shoulders if it keeps up. This lady says, I brought more than three. I said, well, there's no knife police working today, so we might be okay. She's got six, I think. Yep, Hankles. Six of them. This is a returning customer from yesterday. He's got two nice F dicks, a chef's knife, and a big long slicer. I like it. Well, it's a knife day, for sure. Well, I had an upgrade. I went and got two more out of the truck. I had a lady call and said, if I was going to be here all day, I said, well, the weather stays like it is, I'll be here all day. Well, I'm going to bring eight up there. I said, well, I can't show them, but three legally, and this nice police might get me. She said, that's okay, I'll pay for the other five. I said, well, okay, if I'm not busy, I'll do them for you. She's inbound. So I went and got two more heaters and hooked them up. It's uh, still in the... I don't know. I haven't checked the temperature lately, but it's not bad. There's no rain. It's not mist. It's just nasty, cold. But I'm dressed like the nook of the north. How you doing there, everybody? We got three in a bag. I don't know what's in the bag, but aha! Uh -huh. Looks like an old heckle. Uh, Hamilton Beach, that's a fine ticket. And Emperor Steel, uh huh, that's right. Okay. Well, the wind has picked up. It's gotten uh, a bit chillier than I really like it. It's uh, like 2.30, and I haven't had any knives for 45 minutes, maybe an hour. So I got a feeling in about 45 minutes, I might be uh, heading to Rancho Max, unless something changes. I, the lady who <laughs> the lady who called said she had eight knives. Uh, she did have, but apparently she thought I was home. She dropped them off at my house. And the only reason I know that, for some reason, they called Chris and talked to her. She said, well, you know, I didn't realize he was at Whole Foods. So I got knives at home. Eight, it sounds like. I'll get back to you.
the nook of the north. Off. Well, it's four o'clock. I'm going to hit the road. They claim there's some starting to be some sleet fall in some places close by. I think that's going to send me down the river. Well, I made it home. Just a few showers. I better leave this in here. Stand by a minute. I got a, uh, you know, I brought these knives home. That old, that old uh, carbon steel knife and those other three knives or four knives, I forget how many it is. Then I get a telephone call from Chris. So she came home today at lunchtime, which she never does, but apparently she forgot something for work. And uh, while she was here, somebody knocked on the door and dropped off a, she said, a bag of knives. So I said, okay. Well, coming home, I got a call from a guy. He said, yeah, I dropped them off of your wife this morning. I said, that was a good luck. Anyway, I got to have them tomorrow. By noon, I'm leaving. I'm just visiting my mother. I don't know what it looked like. They're in the, Chris says they're in the kitchen. I'm going to go in there and shut this door now and go inside and see what's inside waiting for us. Then I'm going to work on those uh, that old carbon steel knife and whatever he's got. Stand by. Let's go take a look. Okay. See what we got here. We got a Wustal Santuco. Yeah, we got a million knives in here. It looks like a heckle. Baker's Crust Santuco. Another old. This might be a saboteur. I don't see it stamped anywhere. Oh yeah, it is right there. Saboteur. Big long slicer. Another hankle. Another long hankle slicer. Yeah, not in too bad shape. Nothing being dull. Here we got a uh, pamper chef. Poultry scissors. A yeah, nice creature. Then we got a little teeny ankle, pair and knife. And we got another little teeny one. And that's the living end. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight knives and a poultry scissor. All right, we got evening work now. I don't think I ever showed you. I may have showed it to you. I can't remember. My light. These used to be the things I carried to the gun show that would go alongside the table like this and hold my sign up. But I converted it to a light holder now. Hold on a minute. Let me plug this taquito in. Lights, camera, action. Well, we got it. Well, we'll get these bad boys out on the drawing board. Stand by. Well, I made five fives today. In tips. I got all these knives finished. The uh, carbon steel knife really turned out nice. It says made in Germany but it's got 145 stamp right there. ready knife. Once I buffed this one up, cleaned it up, I had to do the rest of them. That's just, I can't help it. 
they look like new now. They'll get a new price, but hope they don't complain. What do you think, boo-boo? Hey, boo-boo. You hungry? You had no supper? I'm wondering you ain't squeaking like an old crow over there. What's wrong with you? You feel bad? You got a fever or something? <laughs> Are you starving to death? You want to say hello to everybody? Oh, no. I'm scared of that thing. Boo-boo. They're all done. Poultry scissors, knives. All right, that's the end of the of the uh, Monday. I don't think anybody went spinning today. If they did, I ain't got any reports. I'll see you tomorrow. Whole Foods. <laughs>